Good morning everyone, this is John Nicholson from Down Estates, Managing Director. Uh, today I'm bringing you a video or two of a beautiful uh, traditional terrace in the heart of the city on the Avenue. This property is coming to market at the offers in the region of £375,000 with no chain. Uh, the property offers accommodation over three floors, potentially over four, uh, as the loft could be uh, converted. Uh, but we do have uh, three floors here, garden, garage, very well maintained home has been occupied by clients for a number of years so there are improvements to be made but ultimately very very nice home here in the heart of the city so let me just give you an idea of the street so some beautiful traditional terraces that run up on the avenue anybody local will know um, obviously located heart of the city easy access into the city but also located um, for uh, some excellent local schools. So let me take you into the property. So this is number seven, the avenue. We have the bay windows, which go right to the top on the property and into this uh, quite charming front door. Little palisade there at the frontage. So we have an entrance vestibule and walks onto a big, nice, uh, reception hallway. So you've got stairs that run up to the first floor as well as to the basement level that's been converted. Firstly I'm going to take you into the main reception space which is on the ground level and this huge entertaining lounge through diner. So we've got two bays in this window which is uh, really nice to let the light in. Fireplace but it, as you can see it's a great uh, reception space um, this is a real, real nice place to, uh, to to entertain from. So there is a multifunctional floor plan to this. It could be moved around depending on the client's preference. But as I said, this is set out as that main reception space. So what I'm going to do now is take you down to the basement level and uh, show you the rooms down there. So on this basement level, we do have a number of rooms. But again, it could be utilised in, in many different ways. So we have another hallway area. As we come down, under the stairs is a WC. Um, I'm gonna go into the first reception room down here. So again, we've got a nice comfortable reception room. Could be potentially used as a bedroom, if need be. There are facilities on this level, uh, easy accessible from this particular room, but this does access into the kitchen, so may look at uh, some amendments to be made if you wanted to utilize it as a bedroom. Off here, which would utilise really well if it was a bedroom and blocked off from the kitchen, is a bathroom. So we've got the corner suite, separate shower cubicle, light coming in from the street there. From uh, Even though we're on basement level, we do have windows bringing some natural light. Off the reception hallway, it's got a useful space here, nice utility space. Again, getting some natural light from the street. And then we're going to go through to the kitchen breakfast room. So breakfast bar, integrated appliances, well fitted as they not 2021 by any means, shape or form, but, but it is very, very well maintained. It has the door which goes out onto the external space here, which for the city to get some garden space is, uh, is a huge plus point. It's a nice little bit of entertaining space, easy maintainable, Quite a pleasant backdrop, as you can see the traditional building at the back there and uh, the city there in the background. So coming down at the bottom of the garden, this is the garage here, this gable end wall. I just want to spin around and show this look of the home. I think it's its best angle, but you can see uh, quite a gorgeous traditional home. Now, many properties in the street have converted the, um, the loft, uh, which... You would assume plan permission wouldn't be an issue. Um, the space up there is huge uh, to do that, but uh, obviously you'd have to go through the necessary consent in order to uh, to do so. So let me take you back up the staircase and we'll get back to the ground floor, walk up the stairs, up onto the first floor and see the bedrooms and facilities there on that first floor. So a nice benefit as you're going up the first floor is a, an original stained glass window. There are a lot of original features in the property with coven, ceiling roses, and as you see here, the stained glass window as we come up. We spin round on the first floor landing. So loft access there. It's a very, very spacious loft. 
uh, with great potential, as many have fulfilled in the street for a loft conversion. Then we've got the master suite, bespoke built in wardrobes done by the client, walk in bay window, nice big bedroom. We have a further bedroom here at the rear, big double bedroom. This is at the rear of the building. And looking down onto the garden space and views over the city. Third bedroom, comfortable single, potentially sacrificed in many respects to get the staircase up into the uh, loft space. And then we have a WC on this floor as well. So that's the video too. I hope you've enjoyed it of the property on the avenue in Durham City. Uh, the property is going to market today. Today is the 27th of July. Be quick, miss or miss out because the marketplace is so, so busy in particular for these types of properties. They are very, very desirable. Many people looking for them. So I don't expect this to be sitting on the market for too long. It's offers in the region of £375,000. For a physical viewing, call 0191 375 7599. Speak to the sales team and we'll get you booked in ASAP. Many thanks.